What up guys, Jared here with Confused Films and today we're gonna to be talking a little bit about the KP Duffel. This bag retails for $188, which is a lot of money, but I was with it with the Kickstarter campaign and I'm just gonna give you my thoughts here on maybe why it might be worth it, why it might not be worth it. So just getting right down into it, we see a really nice look. There's a big compartment at the top here with water resistant zippers. Um, right off the bat, you see um, a bright orange interior. This will vary based on kind of what color you choose. Right here we have a shoe bag for when you put the shoes in the shoe pocket there. Um, I like to opt in for the orange because I just kind of liked it a little bit more. The top is uh, good for tablets um, and a uh, nice soft screen or a soft surface for your screens or whatever. Um, that would not fit an iPad Pro though, just so you know. Right over here we've got a toiletry kit which actually Velcros, as you can see there's a piece of Velcro right here and right one right in the bag. And it actually Velcros to the front of the bag so it's not um, rattling around inside with all of your other stuff. And uh, this actually color matches whatever bag you choose. So you see we have a really big uh, mesh pocket in the one side and then three smaller mesh pockets in the other side and then just your main compartment area for anything else you might have. It's a really nice bag. Again, mirrors whatever you do for the duffel. In the main, we just have the uh, main shoe compartment here, nothing special. Uh, three mesh pockets in the side of the main compartment um, for socks or whatever you would want to put in there, cords. Um, Speaking of cords, right in the front here, we've got the tech pocket, which actually just falls open for you. And here we have tons of pockets just for any cords, um, chargers, phones, extra phones that you might have. Um, I particularly love it just for all my charging cords. I have a lot of different ones, one for my Apple Watch, one for my Mac, one for my iPhone. So there's a lot of things happening there that I just don't want rattling around in my main compartment. It's awesome. Um, in the back here, you see we've actually got a ventilated shoe pocket, which is really nice looking. Again, orange interior, but it keeps the shoes and the smell and everything separate from your clothes, which is really nice. And um, if you're not carrying shoes, you can actually put your dirty clothes in it. So that's just one idea. In the side here, we actually have water bottle pockets, which I don't totally know why they're there. But hey, if you want to carry water with you, um, you are set to go. Um, in, up here we have this tiny little pocket. Again, I'm not 100% sure what you would use this for. I guess random little papers. Um, it takes away from the form if you fill it up, so I wouldn't recommend doing that. Um, here in the front of the bag you have um, phone compartments. You can see that those go really deep and it mirrors on both sides of the bag. So any part, um, pockets that you have on one side of the bag, you can see that these are also on the opposite side. And just get a good look at that form. That's the really, um, that's honest, honestly where this bag shines. Um, as you can see when you pick it up, it just looks really awesome and that's kind of how it carries and yeah so when you're standing that's kind of what you would look like carrying it along it also comes with an arm strap I just didn't use that in this video so I am sorry about that on the bottom here you can see that you've got these little rubber feet and uh, that's just kind of keep it elevated off the ground but just note that the material is different on the bottom of the bag than on the sides and top of the bag so just wanted to note that for you guys anyway guys all in all the pros of this bag are that it's really sleek looking, it looks really good when you carry it along. It's got a lot of good pockets that you just might not find in other bags, um, as well as that awesome tech pocket that's in the front, so your tech's right there, and as well as the phone pockets, again, um, that are in the uh, front sides of the bag, which I really actually use a lot. And um, it's really just great for overnight trips or weekend trips, but I wouldn't really recommend it for week-long trips. I've included the measurements um, at the end of this video right here, um, as well as other things, just tech specs about the bag that you can check out. Um, you can also find these on KP's website. Go check them out. They've got other cool products. But honestly, the quality of this product is really good. You do know that you're getting what you pay for. So I would highly recommend it if you are just looking for something sleek for weekends um, or overnight trips. Guys, I'm Jared. This is Confused Films. Thank you for watching. Come rate and subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one.